It depicted a mesmerizing mermaid named Kala Maria, her eyes seeming to follow Emily wherever she went. The girl was captivated by the artwork and decided to hang it in her room. That night, Emily woke up to the sound of whispers echoing through her room, startled. She turned on her bedside lamp, only to find Kala Maria's painting missing from the wall. Trembling with fear, Emily followed the whispers, which led her to the attic. Emily fell to her knees, grateful to escape the clutches of the vengeful mermaid from that day on. She vowed to never underestimate the darkness that lies within seemingly innocent works of art. These chilling tales remind us that even the most enchanting characters can harbor a terrifying darkness within. Beware the beauty that conceals the horrors of the Inkwell Isles. King Dice was known as the cunning and devious manager of the Devil's Casino in Cuphead's world. In a desperate attempt to save his friend Mugman's soul, Cuphead agreed to participate in a deadly game orchestrated by King Dice. The game took place in a dimly lit room filled with eerie laughter and flickering lights. King Dice towered over Cuphead, grinning maliciously. Cuphead had to roll the dice and land on a number of King Dice's choosing if he succeeded, Mugman would be released. But if he failed, Cuphead's own soul would be forfeit, nervously. Cuphead tossed the dice onto the table. Cuphead's heart pounded in his chest. The room fell silent. And the dice came to a stop. But to his horror, Cuphead saw that the dice had landed on the dreaded number 13. King Dice erupted into wicked laughter, revealing his true form a towering skeletal figure with dice for hands. Cuphead's world twisted and distorted as King Dice reached out, his hands transforming into sharp, jagged dice edges with a single strike. Cuphead's body crumbled into pieces, his soul trapped in the devil's domain forever. From that day on, the echoes of King Dice's laughter could be heard throughout the halls of the casino. Mudman Cuphead's loyal and spirited companion had a mischievous streak that often led them into trouble. Late one night, Mudman found himself alone in the eerie halls of Inquell Manor. Drawn to a grand mirror that adorned the wall, he couldn't resist gazing into its depths. But as he stared at his own reflection, the image began to change. Mudman's reflection twisted and contorted. Revealing a malevolent version of himself, its eyes glowed with a sinister light, and a wicked grin spread across its face. Mugman tried to step back, but his reflection reached out, its hand emerging from the mirror's surface. Mugman stumbled backward, but he couldn't escape. The malevolent reflection pulled him into the mirror, trapping him in a nightmarish world where his doppelganger reigned supreme. The real Mugman's pleas for help echoed through the halls. But his friends were powerless to rescue him from the twisted. Cuphead, the titular character of the game, was known for his brashness and desire for adventure. Cuphead and Mugman found themselves in a peculiar part of Inkwell. Isle, filled with strange and distorted landscapes, as they ventured deeper. The world around them began to warp and twist. Cuphead's confidence wavered, but his determination pushed him forward. They stumbled upon an ominous door. Intrigued, Cuphead opened it, only to find himself face to face with a doppelganger and exact replica of himself, but with soulless eyes and a malevolent grin. 